Hello React Native Developers, what is going on? William here, recording from beautiful Zurich, Switzerland. Yesterday, someone asked on Twitter if such a custom slider can be done in React Native. I think it can in a couple of very simple steps. First, we have a container with some border radius. This container has two components as shell run. First, a progress component, which is animated on its width, on the X animation value, and the cursor, which we can use uh, interactable component to implement. And we will give the X animation value to drive the animation. And for each um, value, we will have a stamp point. Can we do it in five minutes or less? Let's have a look. So here I have my container and so two children and we're gonna start with a cursor component. We're gonna create a X animation value which will drive Z animation. So we need to give it as parameter as well as the count of items and we give the size as well. So let's create the cursor component. Again, we need reanimated. So we have X, which is of type value, count, which is a number, size, which is a number. And we're gonna use interactable, interactable from Redash. Redash is my utility tool bet for reanimated. And so we're gonna wrap an animated view as a child. So we need to calculate the snap point, make it working only horizontally and give the x value to drive the animation. So let's get the properties, count, size from the props, and we can calculate the snap points. So we're gonna create a new array of the size of the number of elements on the slider. We fill it with some random value. We do a map to return the snap point based on the index. So we're going to return x is index times the size. And here, let's do some styling to our cursor. So we know that width is size, height is size, border radius is size divided by two, background color white, um, border, weave, I think we can use this color here. Uh, we are going to need some shadow. This looks good. Let's have a look. All right, looks pretty good. Now let's do the progress bar. So we're gonna create an animated view with some styling. And we start with the absolute fill. Background color, let's see if we can color pick. Yeah, that looks good actually we need to set the border radius as well and the width which is going to be the x value plus the size
All right, looks pretty good. Last step is gonna be adding the current value of the cursor. We're gonna use retext, retext from redash as well, which is a component I use to have a text value, which is driven by an animation value. So we're gonna give index as parameter. So I'm gonna need a couple of operators, divide, round, add, and index is add plus one of the rounded value of x divided by the size. Let's have a look. And we are gonna need some styling. All right, I think that looks pretty good. What do you guys think? I think that was fast and it can be done in React Native. Guys, if you enjoy these videos and you would like to support the channel, you can buy me a coffee and I will give you access to the private GitHub repository where I tinker with all these examples. And if you have a new React Native projects coming up, I recommend you check out React Native Elements, premium starter kit for React Native. It's 80% of what you need when started a new React Native project. I've done my magic with this, time to do yours. And I'm looking forward to talk to you guys soon. And in the meantime, happy hacking.